So I think for a leader, there are a number of key uh, characteristics. First, I think you need to lead with conviction. I think people need to understand what you are trying to achieve. I think you need to lead with clarity. People need to understand what is actually being asked of them. And I think you need to lead with courage because often it is the decisions that the, the leader or the leadership teams make that many people may say, I don't think that's the right decision. But instinctively, a good leader will know that that is the right decision and they will have the courage to continue with that. But I think overarching all three of those aspects, you have to lead with compassion. And I think compassion right now is even more important than it has ever been. You can see that people are still post-pandemic struggling. They're struggling in quiet ways. They're struggling in more pronounced ways. And you have to appreciate that. And you have to look at everything through a compassionate lens. Because right now, all of those meaningful exchanges that you are having are building back up trust between employees, between employer, and that's the only way that we can drive forward as a business. And it's the only way that people will follow you as a leader. The most valuable piece of advice that I have received is to listen more than I talk. And I think that is the only way as a leader that you can actually understand what the genuine issues are before you and listen properly, actively listen. Don't feign it. Don't give the impression that you're going to do something with that information. Listen properly and always go back to people if you have said that you're going to do something. Certainly in my career, the most frustrating thing that I ever would deal with was I would speak to somebody, they would say, I have got this, William, I will sort this out and I will come back to you. And they never did. And that always stayed with me. And I've really learned from that, that I never commit to doing anything and not going back on it.